All right, all right. LDBC, it is your boy Coach Sheldon Harrison. You're live, live, live on the Coach Sheldon Harrison Combat Sports Show Live. Austin, no doubt, Trout versus Jamel Charlo. Man, dang, what a fight. What a fight. What a fight, bro. <laughs> hey, man, this was a good fight. Um, I, the fight could have went either way. This fight was close to me, man, in, in my opinion, okay? My opinion, because I know we got some sensitive dudes that, that be running around here on YouTube, okay? In my opinion, I thought this was a very, very close fight. Um, I had Jamel Charlo winning the fight, though, because I just thought Jamel was tagging Austin Trout with the more clean and the more damaging strikes, man. That's what I thought. You know, um, you know, Austin Trout had his moments, man. You know, he stunned Jamel Charlo a few times. And I was like, you know, I didn't know Trout, you know, could, could actually, you know, pop that hard. I thought that Jamel was going to eat all the Trout shots and just take, walk him down and knock him out. But that's not what happened, man. Trout surprised me in this fight he actually stunned the guy a few times and uh jamel charlo responded you know he one of them guys when you hit him you know his response is to try to hit you back you know and that's what he was doing um i just thought jamel charlo man his shots were just more damaged and they were more meaningful man they did more and if i'm a judge you know i'm looking at that like yeah you know maybe trout may have hit jamel more maybe you know and that's a big maybe but when jamel was hitting trout man it's just you can i mean trout head dropping back man you know, he, he he's staggering, he moving back. And Jamel staggered Trout a few times, man, staggered him. And uh, Trout staggered Jamel about twice in this fight. But, you know, it wasn't enough to to have him, like, try to jump on, you know, uh, Jamel Charlo. Now, when Jamel Charlo had Austin Trout hurt, Jamel jumped on that dude like a lion. <laughs> oh, lions only. He jumped on him, man. He jumped on him heavy and started trying to go to work on him. But Trout being a veteran, man, he actually, what he did, he started, uh, when Jamel got in on the inside, Trout started paring in a lot of those shots, man, and started moving his head, and uh, Jamel couldn't get him up out of there. There were points in the fight, though. I really, I thought Jamel had him, man, but Trout, Trout is slippery, man. I mean, you mess around, man, and you play around with Austin Trout. You can't play with this dude, because Austin Trout to mess around, man, and start sneaking in and winning rounds, man. And, um, you know, Jamel didn't let that happen. You know, Jamel stayed on his game. I like Jamel Charlo's jab, man. He kept a constant jab in Trout's face, and he kept disrupting Trout's offense. Trout had to keep resetting, man. And I'm like, God, dog, man. Jamel Charlo is a much improved fighter, man. He's improved, especially from when the last time I saw him. And I also like Jamel's head movement, man. I like this head movement. He wasn't there to be hit, you know. In some of his previous fights, man, I've actually seen him where, you know, he would absorb shots, man. He absorbed a lot of them. But, you know, he'd come in and, you know, he'd actually get the knockout because the guy got the power. Well, you know, Austin Trout hit him with some shots. But Jamel never really took a lot of Austin shots head on. He took a few where Austin, you know, caught him clean. But Jamel was actually moving his head, man, and uh, he was moving and turning his body, man, to decrease the, the, the power and the force of Trout's blows, man. So Jamel was able to absorb a lot of Trout's punishment and not even be hurt, man. But uh, I had to tell you, man, this fight was close. It was real close, man. And I thought in some points of the fight, I thought Trout was outboxing Jamel Charlo. And then some points of the fight, I just thought Jamel Charlo was hitting Trout so hard, man, that that could have also been swaying the judges. But it was a good fight, man. I actually think I want to see a rematch, man. I didn't think this fight was going to be as competitive as it was. I thought Jamil Charlo was going to come in here and just, guys, I hate to say it. I thought he was just going to, you know, run through Trout. I thought he was. Because I thought that Trout, you know, his better days were behind him. But, you know, I think Trout got some better days ahead of him. Shout out to Jamil Charlo, man, for the victory. Okay, it was a close fight, hard fought victory. But Jamil Charlo, Lions only, won this fight. And that... That's just the way that is. This is your boy, Coach Shelton Harrison. I'm done. What are you waiting on? Subscribe.